Hey, uh, how you doing there? Yes. Just need to heal up and I'll... We can go outside and have a nice chat. How's that? Come on. Right away. Uh, not fast enough. Even with my increased agility, that didn't do much. Well, at least he didn't kill me, so... Oh, well. Miller, I'm sick and tired of reminding you that you have no authority and that you need my approval on all matters of security. Also, I'm fed up with pointing out to you over and over again how sloppy and inadequate the safety precautions on Parnerby Station are, especially serious of security deficiencies in the colony. And please don't tell me again those saurians are peaceful, cuddly creatures. There are neither turrets nor security cameras there. In case of an attack, the colony will be completely defenseless. I demand that you remedy this situation immediately or I will file an official complaint against you. Are you serious? That's not gonna work. This is Triop. They don't respond to threats like that. In fact, that's exactly what gets them riled up and cause even more stupid and irresponsible trouble. Oh, Decker. You may be trying to, you may be a wannabe Diego, but you're nowhere near the level of Diego that the fact that you could be intimidating. Diego, though, is probably like the most badass of the UN in commanders. Ah, oh, well. You loot, you yeah, live and you do this. Yeah, I don't even know what to think of. Okay, I think I've searched everything up here. Alright, let's go. I feel so much better that I don't have to keep saving and redoing parts. Perfecting things is always annoying. I prefer to play the game and just have fun with it, even if I die a lot. I'll just leave the professional stuff up to people like uh, Ship of Reborn. That's a real pro. Alright. And the music's popping up again. That can only mean one thing. First, there's a camera I have to destroy. Alright. Let's get my psychogenic strength recharged before we move on. Good. Okay, anybody want to die? How about you, mister? You look like a good candidate. There you go. Have a nice sleep. Now, I'm pretty sure there's a cyber bitch here somewhere. There you are. And you're killing me! You bastard. How embarrassing. Whoa. Damn. These guys throw their shrunken pretty damn fast. It's almost scary. Oh, where the hell? What the... Ah, uh, what a mess. You're welcome. Alright, let's go take care of Mr. Fusion. Since he decided to crash my party and wait in the uh, crew quarters for me. There you are. Party's over, guys. You're all dead. Like you should be. And now, we all, now that the music stopped, we can play some logs, and it actually is appropriate. Dicker, you don't need to be constantly reminding me of my duties. The development of the colony is top priority for Trioptimum. And if in six months the first colonists are slated to arrive, and before then, a colony center has to be enlarged and made ready. At the moment, we really have no time to waste on installing unnecessary devices like turrets or cameras. Therefore, I strongly recommend that you do your own job, which should include keeping your men away from the officer's quarters and seeing that they stay sober once in a while. <laughs> uh, to be honest... Decker and um, Miller are not exactly my favorite rivals in the fan missions. I think my favorite rivals are Polaris. I don't think there is any rivalry in, this, in Nightwalker, though, because there's only one leader, but Polaris is my favorite of the pair. 
well, behind Diego and Anatoly, because, let's face it, Diego and Anatoly are pretty cool characters. Not the usual bad guys, not the usual good guy, bad guy thing, but pretty cool. Expert tech. Mm, I think I'll keep it with me, just in case. Still a while, still a little while before I explore everything, so let's listen to some more logs. The UNN Nightwalker is approaching the station and will arrive within a short time. We have to find a way to warn it off. Under no circumstances can we allow the UNN Nightwalker to be allowed to dock with the station. Do you think you can piece together a temporary transmitter to send a warning? Search through the spare parts and storage and see if you can find something useful. Alright, so there's a response log to that that reveals the code. It's in the center room, but, you know, why rush? There's no need to rush. At least not yet, anyway. I'm going to have a good enough reason to get the hell out before uh, everything goes down. Which is primarily why I don't want to rush. I like the peace and quiet. Always a nice time to relax, lay back, listen to some audio logs, and, you know... Just look at the dead corpses running on the floor and looting their stuff at the same time. Scavenging from the dead. I'm not sure if it's something that would defile the dead or something that they would allow you to do in any circumstance. It's, it would, I think it would be better if I had their permission. I'm not that cruel. I'm not like Garrett who steals things when they're even alive. Or I'm not that kind of person who tries to get the tries to take the easy way of getting money or some such like that by stealing something rare or valuable from the dead. Eh, I'm not really one to judge, so I can't really say too much on the issue. I'm just here to have fun, and I'm actually getting a little bit tired. It's like almost 12 at night over here. In the middle of a big forest. A big scary forest. In the middle of the mountains, for that matter. Uh, it's definitely great that I no longer get uh, terribly annoyed. A lot less screw-ups now. A whole lot less, and that makes me a happy man. Almost happy, that is. Okay, any more... Lots of food. Apparently they were having a party here. This must be like a lounge for the UNN garrison, judging by, uh... You know, the pool tables... And the band equipment over there. Little eating area here. And the people wearing UNN outfits. Hi there. Please make your selection. No thanks. Lots of food and definitely a lot of alcohol, so yeah. And not only that, but there's the symbol, un Unity Secured by Force. So there was quite a party going on here before they all got slaughtered. Ah, <laughs> let's play instruments. If only there was some way to play them all and make some kind of song out of it. That'd be so awesome. All right. Play a log. The code for the storeroom oh. is 21749. There isn't much ammo left, though, so ration it well. I hadn't thought we might ever need to use this ammo. The biggest problem until now has been keeping you all from boozing it up, what with the deadly boredom on this space station. I know none of you expected all these events, but now things have changed, and I expect 100% from each of you. We will destroy Shodan and her creatures. God save the UNN. I really wish he had emphasized that last line just a little more. Like D Diego's epic, God save the UNN. Or something like that, you know? I mean, he kind of didn't do it j any justice, because that line is like one of the best lines in System Shock 2. Oh well. You can't have everything you're going for, you know, a fandom thing. Wait, what did I just say? Oh, I'm tired. Damn. There. 
Sleepy, sleepy head. Alright, I think we got about everything we can on... Let me check again real quick. Yeah, we, we got everything. Any, little, any logs left? Yeah, that's about it. Just the chemical manifest. Here it is, the transmitter. 24 star modules and a log. We'll listen to that log real quick while I get suited up, because we're about to have a lot of action coming up. It was anything but easy to piece together a usable transmitter with those spare parts, but now I'm finished. I just have to activate it. The code is 87312. Hopefully, the UNN Nightwalker will heed the warning and stay away from Ponterby Station. What was that? Seriously? You're gonna ask, what was that? Why don't you, you know, assume the worst and get ready to defend yourself rather than let him get the, let the hybrid get the advantage and just slaughter you utterly? Well, it's your loss, not mine. Alright, hold on. My powers are about to die. Alright. I'm ready. Alright, let's do this! Code is easier than I thought it'd be. Oh well. Here we go! Onward to the bridge! <laughs> 